on board, here board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> <sighs> what else is wrong? Hmm, nothing. Just trying to catch this guy. I don't get how he just outsmarts everyone. Well, at least you, uh, you know, altered your costume and your appearance and. Makes it at least easier for other branding of criminals. Yeah. But I can't catch this one person. I need help just to have a chance to apprehend him. You failed! Uh, I... Well, you didn't have to say it like that. Well, you did? <sighs> hmm. I have to find a way to get him some way, somehow. But it's so much more complicated than I previously thought. Usually, heck. I'd have been work, be the shit out of him. But for some reason, this one kid has so much experience almost. It's like he's. This isn't his first fight. Something like that. Yes. Who knows? Maybe this truly isn't his first real wolf. He's older than he appears. Uh, like what? Possibly my age? Or... He seems rather reckless. Which would make sense. With his ability to seemingly walk through shadows. <laughs> hmm. Yeah. I mean, that would kind of makes sense, but... Mm. What if it isn't as simple as we thought previously? Like, what if this quirk isn't a shadow-walking quirk, or what if it's something more... I don't know. Mm. Try not to stress yourself too much. You... Looks like you can use as much sleep as possible. Luckily, I'm taking the students right now. Today, so don't, no need to fret. <sighs> yeah, you're right. As yes, this is the whole Heroes vs. Villains test. In which, as soon as Izuku sees all my, he is on guard right Motherfucker! How? Why are you here? I'm teaching. What? I am the teacher for today. When does our sensei? He's taking a well-deserved nap. Uh. But seriously, you're a teacher. Yes. You are a teacher. Are you serious? But you're such an idiot. 
indispensable hero. I would assume that you'd be more useful on the front lines combating villains. Yes, uh, usually, yes, I would. But I thought it would be uh, helpful to use my hero knowledge and help train the younger generation as sooner or later will be replacing me. Yeah. That's that's great. That's, <laughs> Are you alright, young Midoriya? Um yeah. Just I didn't expect to see no one hero here. <laughs> yeah. Oh, are you shitting me? As far as teams go, they're the same. One thing is Suzuku, he's pretty much trying his best not to look any kind of familiar. He has his uh, hero costume, not his religion, uh, vigilante one. But still, he's like, oh, I have to be as incognito as possible. So, chances are I'm going to have to just do a portal... Go in and out. Easy peasy. Because he knows if he starts using his spying style, which All Might has seen and fought against, it's going to be raising some flags instantly, in, even in All Might's head. So, he's like, okay. Easy way or hard way? The choice is yours. Um, the easy way, I guess. Good. And just po doing a portal. It just having it be right above. Like, well, what are we doing now? You're gonna jump in this portal, and I'm gonna try to find out where the bomb is hidden. Oh, okay. Is this gonna hurt? Araga, right, just trust me. Can you do? Can you do me that kindness? Just trust me. I ain't. It's not gonna be. A, it's not going against your sick or anything. Okay, fine. As then, yes, they find out where the bomb is, and Izuku and Oraka win. Bakugo, though he is a bit, you could say, Aryan, it's not as easy when it comes to Izuku actually being able to teleport his explosions right back on his ass. Easy. Er. Now, all my nose is like, okay. This Midoriya boy, yes, I, he seems to be very used to fighting. The way his body is, his whole quirk thing is pretty much very useful. I mean, there are that many people who can make portals. Plus, hmm, his costume seems to be very practical. I, for some reason, I, I feel like I've seen it before. Something feels so familiar. I don't know why. But, yeah, he has to get rid the whole class finished, so, yeah, he'll just move that on the rug. Of course, the USJ event, Izuku is actually. It's like, finally. Easy class. It's only when he realizes, oh my god, what? All my Anazawa are here? And thirteen? Are you serious? He's a bit more nervous. Spending time with three people who would obviously give him more of a difficult time if he were found out. But he just tries to stay calm. Heck, it's just a simple rescue exercise. No need to worry about it. 
but he's considering shooting bricks when he realizes, oh my god, there's a Vimon's attack. So he has to choose, like, how bad does he fight? How much of his fighting style does he allow to be shown here? Which, yeah, he's happy that, hell, 13 is out commission, though he feels sorry for her. And because of the no will appear, he, he's pretty much like, thank you for being the shit out of Aizawa. Because of Froppy and Manila, they're pretty much shitting bricks while he's like, yes, now I can finally let loose and what's some ass. He does. Much of the Rocky and everyone else is like, wow, this, wait, was he always this good at fighting? Some of the others do is like, or I was like, wait, what's going on? Bongo, he shows up, he's, oh, come on. It's bad enough that you can be on pretty much anywhere, but now you can fight too? Okay. So it's like, I'm going to train even more. The Nomu is difficult for Izuku to be since he's not relatively strong. But heck, he can read the red bullets with his portals. Why not punches too? Only thing is, with Kodagiri there, he's pretty much going up against someone who has the exact power as him. Just different colors to gain. Uh, yes, he has to deal with the fact that every time his portal redirects the Lose punch, Kogiri is doing the same thing. Maybe so they just barely graze him. So he is uh, pretty much trying to outlast the Nomu or Kogiri. But when All Might shows up, Izuku gets pimp slapped right next to him. Like, of course you're here. What took you so long? As yes, he does feel like, okay, finally, so, something good. I can hang back here. Then he sees all my starting to get hurt and lose. This is what he's really like, oh man, don't tell me I gotta save him. And, okay. Just gotta make sure it's not too obvious of how, when it comes to certain things. Easy, I've done it before. Hey, I can do it again. Ew, how wrong you are. Because again, just like Yusuke can redirect, so can Kodagiri. So he's trying his best to keep All Might from getting skewered, punched, stabbed, his organs gouged out. And all this concentration is pretty much really pissing him off. To the point where he actually makes a technical portal headset for All Might. Where he can direct him into where to punch, make it look like, oh wait, he's doing just randomness while Yasuku is luckily redirecting all my punches now. As well as redirecting no moves, so it looks like they're going through all might. Well, they're actually just being redirected back at the no move. Gorigiri, when it comes to portals, yeah, he can make a lot of them at once. As well as when it comes to the whole concentration aspect needed. Izuku having to redirect bullets, sometimes even a split second decision, he's more used to the quickness. Especially with Nagant, of all people, being his uh, mentors. So the 500 punches. Turn out to be uh, 500 more. So Nomu is obliterated by All Might and his own punches. We'll go to Shigaraki. He's like, yep, we are out of here. Just as Snipe just shoots him. Izuku falling into his old habits of redirecting bullets. He is ricocheting the bullets. Constantly, to the point where Shigaraki is pretty much in a cage of one bullet, constantly almost nicking him. 
is everyone's looking. What are you doing? I'm apprehending a villain. Keep shooting. Keep shooting so he doesn't get away. As then you recognize that way. That's that's from that seems somewhat familiar. He hears the muttering like, "Oh shit! Wait, that's right. That's what I did when my dad died." Him losing his concentration just enough so Corey can get Sugar Rocky out of there. And on one hand, he's like, "Damn it! I should have just I should have just ended him that right there. The anime and everything, the manga would have been done." But no. They're still looking at him like, okay, what the hell is with you? Well, Zuku is, of course, like, wow, that sucks. <sighs> I'm sorry, it's all because of me that they got away. Him looking all pissed as well as like, I can't believe this actually happened. Them just piling on their bags, like, you could have. It's okay. It's not your fault. Snipe, of course, is still suspicious as hell. But the way you did that was very impressive. What? Ricocheting the bullet, bullet like that with your portals is. Kind of reminds me of something. Huh? Yeah. I mean, huh, I really wonder. Okay, so uh, what should we tell the, the you know, news, news people and everything? You know, just, just a little reference. Just, just, just wanted to know what, what are we going to tell them? Hmm. No, nothing. Just, uh been on attack, they somehow will infiltrate you away, you know. Eh, don't, nothing to worry about. When it comes to them talking about the whole, there's a possibility of a traitor, Snipe instantly just thinks of Zoomidoria. What? All my Azawa, Mike, are you serious? Uh, I don't know. But yes, I, I think he might be the traitor. That's ridiculous, ludicrous even. Why would he be the traitor? Think about it. His dad was killed. He was on the hook for countless charges of uh, what was it now? Murder? Not to mention the whole fact that the way the were killed were very abnormal. You also gotta consider the fact that, uh, huh, the way he was killed was actually very interesting too. Snipe, are you honest to God? Look, I know how it sounds, but just think about it. To just say that this kid was responsible for all that. I mean, I know. So, what? You want us to question him? No. We wait to see what he does. If he, as long as he's not too suspicious or anything, we can rule him out as the potential traitor or spy or whatever. Really? Yes. Still, something is so familiar. Excuse me. Excuse me. We know that kid has a portal for it. That's pretty much it. So. Yeah, his dad's quirk is pretty useful too. 
Mm. Either way, all that matters is we should uh, put a lid on this. Or at least put a pin in it. Make sure that we don't worry anyone. You just accuse one of the students and a student who has been through enough of being the traitor. I just can't stake this feeling. Like, oh my god, that's how I was it. He acted it strange in class or anything. At least, not really, just like a new student. On the other hand, while I was running up to him, he just seemed quite frightful. Might just say, well, that's just you, you're terrifying. Especially when you do that creepy smile. <clears throat> <clears throat> but other than that, he didn't really seem to have much issues, but he has been glaring at me every so often, just trying to see what I was doing, it seems. Okay. I guess nothing too out of the ordinary. What about you, All Might? He seemed very surprised that I was there. Really? Yeah. He didn't call me. He was just like, uh, oh, I was an indispensable member of uh, Hero Society and whatnot. I sure he wasn't going to call you an idiot. Uh, what? No, I mean. Hmm. The. Now that you mention it, maybe. Okay, we're gonna need someone to keep a close eye on this kid. I mean, on one hand, it doesn't seem like he would do anything just out of the ordinary. But we can't be too sure until later. So you expect us to just to, what, spy on this kid to see if he messes up? Yes. Wait. I did know something else quite strange. Like what? When he was helping me defeat the Nomu as well as the other villains, he did conjure up two portals, one around my mouth and the other my ear to direct me on a plan he had. What? He made a headset out of his portals, technically. Really? Yes, I thought it was the strangest thing. Then Aizawa just is like, wait, now that I think about it, when the villain attack was occurring, I did catch a few glances of 13. Well, what's that got to do with anything? Well, red thinking, what was weird is, young Midoriya seemed to have this strange look of relief as well when she was incapacitated. And same could go for me as soon as he, he thought I was down for the count. But when he started going up against the Nomo, he was notably having issues with it. Plus the way he was fighting, it was weird. What do you mean? The way he was, Dodging. It seemed abnormal. I mean, I've seen some people with some exceptional writing skills. The only thing is, it seemed to be very unique. Yeah. Unique. 
yes, it's actually quite interesting. But I can't shake the feeling that I've seen it before. Don't know from where, but yeah, I've definitely seen the way he fights. At least his dodging. Because fighting that abomination was. That was not what he was doing. Well, anyone else want to doubt me? <laughs> yes, everyone's looking at Snipe, Azawa, as well as All my like, okay, we will admit this kid is strange, but you gotta remember, he hasn't had the easiest life either. His dad was accused of thievery as well as murder. In which Nagant was heading up the whole investigation, but did kill him while they were out on a father son bonding trip. He didn't know until after the fact that her already being really engaged with his family. That's right. Hmm. Nagant. She was a first gang his father. And killed him. We just... Huh. Interesting. <sighs> What's wrong, I was Just tired. Damn it. Can I can I just go? Because this is really starting to cut into my sleeping hours, and I still had to go out on patrol today to find Shadow Walker. Oh yes, midnight. What? We'll need your help this time. Why? We have all my no. <laughs> He was useless. Uh, no, what? That was not useless. No, you, you are outsmarted. You know, yes, he couldn't overpower you. That's the whole fact that he was so quick to outsmart you just to give him enough cover so he could use his quirk, knowing that I could look at him. Well, yeah, you do have a point. And that is, uh, do I have to? Well, no, I suppose you don't. But I guess this uh, vigilante is just going to keep on killing until I can get him. I can nullify his quirk. You just have to make sure that he's breathing in all that good good. Uh, wh wait, what? You know what I mean. Fine. I'll help you. What I still see it is a bit unnecessary. No. It is very necessary. For I have to do. I just wish I knew who this guy was. And who knows? Maybe every single one that looks like you could distract him even more. Hmm. You know what? I'll help you. In fact, if you need me for anything else, even afterwards, yeah, because I'm not going to lie, I kind of have a bone to pick with that Shadow Walker guy. Really? Yes. Hmm. What happened? 
he them people and he's like no <laughs> please <laughs> no he's not that lucky but uh, what is it okay he actually apprehended some criminals that I was investigating really yes now you decided to tell us nothing right but wait what the, was that the case in where the people shot themselves uh, uh it was wasn't it you said they were so scared of riding on someone that they decided just to end it because they knew they couldn't escape you. Uh, <clears throat> poor shame on you. Shut up. Seriously, I didn't plan on, plan on it. And plus, you did comment about my hero costume that kind of hurt my feelings. What did you say? <laughs> Uh, that uh, for the way I kind of, way I dress, hero work isn't uh, this isn't the place for uh, me to re to live my uh, fantasies. He didn't. He did. So he actually called you out on the way you dress, saying that you were feeling a fantasy. Yeah, he told me that I should give up on being a hero and just be a dominatrix like I'm obviously trying to be. Who said that? Who, who, who's laughing? No one is. Mike just burst into pure laughter. He was just like, I can't believe this shit. <laughs> he called you out on your bullshit. Finally, someone said it. It is a fucking vigilante. <laughs> Oh, this is perfect. It's not funny. Oh, yo, you're right. It's hilarious. Oh, man. You have no idea how long I want to tell you that. You don't like my costume? Oh, no. That's the problem. I do like it. I like it a lot. That's That's the issue. We're supposed to command respect, but what you do is instill some secret feelings within people. Some hand desires. <laughs> I mean, the way you use your part too, with your terror costume. You can't, you can't deny. You can't blame us for thinking that you had a different career options in mind. Uh, you really just said that? Oh, yes, I did. I am so happy I did. They're going on and on and on. This is what Snipe knows is something on all my... This little black and green spot. He was just... Wait. What's that on you? Huh? What's that? He, he was just turning around and just, there's there's something on on you. Just tap your shoulder. It's like, what? Uh, uh, sniper, is this one of your jokes? No, no. I swear, there was something on your shoulder. It was black and green for some reason. Are you just trying to further incriminate young Midoriya? No. Look, we don't know how capable he is with his quirk. Oh no, I know how capable he is. I 
Just saying. We remind you to keep an eye on this kid. That's it. If just can't put my finger on it. Something is not right. Hmm. Very well. Either way, yes, we will keep an eye out for young Medoya. But we can't just, you know, make it too obvious. And we definitely should look into the staff. Seriously. Snipe, what's wrong with you accusing young Medoya? He's been through enough. Listen, I know how it sounds, but still, trust me on this. As the meeting is finally, bye bye, let's get this over with. Because of the whole two re weeks, is everyone's just trying to train as much as they can. Izuku is training more with Nagant. Pretty much saying, oh, I think I possibly fucked up. <laughs> what? Well, I heard it on that little meeting, and yeah, Snape is at least on to me. Really? <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. He, he's actually considering you or your vigilante. No, he thinks I'm a traitor. What? Yeah, even Aizawa said, hey, I look kind of relieved when he and, you know, 13 were incapacitated. Were you? Yes, I was like, I could go off if I wanted to. But damn, he wasn't supposed to see my expression. Maybe I need to wear a mask. You, you already do. It's like, no, no, I mean, you know what I mean. Yeah, but wouldn't that just further incriminate you the more you change your hero costume to look more like your vigilante costume? Don't you think that would be kind of a red flag or smoking gun or whatever they say when you're about to incriminate yourself? Damn. Yeah, yeah, you have a point. So how is your uh, versatility? Well, like I said before, I pretty much redirected all my punches. I no move things, punches like nobody's business. So my rap is succession of uh, you know portal generation as well as changing and redirecting them has gotten a lot better. <sighs> What was really a pain in the ass is pretty much this other villain. You mean the one with the portals like yours? Yeah. Said the color scheme's different, of course, but still. Man, I don't get it. Well. <sighs> I'm a little tired, so we're done with training for right now. I um, guess I'm just going to relax and... <laughs> what? Last time you relaxed, every target I had uh, acquired for you was shot up to high hell. Well, I won't get rusty. Hmm. Whatever. <sighs> just, just make sure to let me know if you need anything. Seriously, I just want you to hurry up and expose the hero association so I can come out of hiding. You do know you're still gonna get arrested if you. Just come out like that, like, yeah, but still. As soon as I do, the Hero Association should be arrested. If all goes according to plan. 
point, you have been gathering more and more evidence of their wrongdoings. I'm surprised you want more. Duh, because it only goes so far. I mean, if I could buy more evidence of them doing things dirty, that would seem better. The further back it is, even better. Because it just shows how far gone they've been, been doing all this. Which is helpful. Which you can't deny. Still feels like you're stalling. I don't get why, but... Yeah, whatever. Still giving the guy a kiss on the cheek and leaving. Hurts. Just wait. Just wait up to till you ain't no kid no more. I am going to destroy you. He's either just feeling the slight chill in the air. She should, she, she should go. I ain't never gonna be the same again as soon as, soon as I turn 18. I, I know for a fact I won't. When it comes to the whole, you can guess. It's too easy for a zuku when it comes to the whole fact that. Okay, so first event is a race. Portal here, portal there, he's gone. He first place, 10 million points. He makes portals all, all throughout the whole area of his whole team. No one can touch him. It is difficult when he. He's uh, trying to keep his mouth shut and Shinso. So he's definitely trying, like, okay, nope, nope, nope. I, I, I'm not going to talk. I'm just going to beat you senseless or make you concede defeat or knock you out or whatever. Get you out of the ring, either or. I need to win this. Him doing that, but not before yelling out in pure victory. Saying, yeah, I didn't say a damn word to your ass. Slap yourself in the face. When it comes to him versus Toroki, it's a lot more difficult. To the point where he, he does have to teleport glaciers of ice to keep himself from getting frozen solid. And the rookie is not laying up in the slightest because he's like, yes, I am going to kick your ass. Is my destiny type of thing, honor and whatnot. Which luckily for Izuku, I still get to do the Tano Jutsu though. I realize he hasn't had an easy life either. So before he actually beats Shoto, he does talk to him about, yeah, it's your quirk and everything. As he does look up right at Endeavor and flip him off in front of everyone. Endeavor's pride demands he beat the shit out of Izuku. But him being a hero and him like, come on, man, you gotta, you gotta let kid get to you like that? He just brushes it off as best he can. Shows, okay. It's like you're not all bad. But he still gets beaten by Izuku. When it comes to Izuku versus Ida, he's like, Ida, my friend, you know you can't beat me. Mm, I, we won't know until I try. Are you serious? Yes. Okay, fine. He just summons portals all throughout the stage, on the floor. So wherever he has tips, he has the added risk of not knowing where he's gonna pop up. But chances are it's gonna be outside the ring. So, do you still think you can win against me? Uh, you also know I can shoot portals like a gun, right? 
What? You're just making a finger gun? As he shoots multiple portals at Ida, he's like, dance for me, puppet, dance! Ida falling into one on the floor and out of the ring. His pride is hurt. <sighs> at least I tried. Damn, that's fucked up. Everyone enjoying the show while also like, man, come on, someone give him an actual challenge besides Todoroki. In comes Bakugo, and considering he can fly, that same trick isn't going to work on him. So Izuku has no choice but to actually fight Bakugo. Is yes, thanks to Mike and as I was commentary. I was like, wait, what the fuck? Him starting to take notice even more aspects of Izuku's fighting. The way he's using his portals. And All Might's like, wait, he's doing the same thing he did for me. He's thinking about us. He is very proficient in fighting. What the hell? Even to the point where he knocks out Bakugo. Though he wins, what he does at the end of it, just posing for victory, he's like, I was like, motherfucker, I know exactly who you are. As yes. All Might, he does give Izuku the, the medal, but then he's like, <laughs> He's just looking up at all my is all my is having a half assed smile looking down with those sunken eyes. He's a good right now it's like he's looking at pure death right now. He's like, Come meet me after the pleasantries and festivities, if you don't mind. And then, as soon as he does, he's thinking about running away, but that would definitely confirm their suspicions. But maybe I could talk my way out of this. It's still in the back of his mind. So. <sighs> shit, 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 shit. Okay. I have some hopes here. There's no guarantee that they know everything. So if I can keep my mouth shut and not over explain or overshare, I can probably get out of this. Heck, it's all might. Then he shits a golden bar. When he sees Aizawa was there too with one named Snipe. Hey, what's going on? You're the vigilante. What? And you're a traitor. Ah. Is this true in Midoriya? What? What? No! I... What makes you think that? Your fighting style, the way you have a breath of fresh air after me and 13 got bodied. Them just going on and on, especially the way you've, you utilize your portals so efficiently. Damn. Looks like I got no choice. So now you just have it like, yes. Okay. Can you please explain? Like, I kind of idolize the god. What? Y yeah. I mean, yeah, she was my mentor, and though, yeah, she turned out to be the one that killed my dad, I can't help but still admire her as, you, you know? Uh. Wait, really? I think. 
What's that got to do about being a traitor or a vigilante? It's like, that's not me. Wait, there's a traitor at UA? Uh, oops. Oh, damn. It's like, <laughs> all my just like, we're not sure about that yet. But, how can you claim not to be the vigilante given your fighting style? That's just the one that Nagant taught me. I mean, she worked closely with the Hero Association, didn't she? I'm sure I'm not the only one she taught. Then I'm recognizing, oh, wait, yeah. If anything, given her history of being a hero, she, chances are, yeah, she has taught several people. Hawks being one of them, so it was like, oh. So you wait, you guys thought I was a vigilante? And a traitor? Yeah, sorry. Uh, no, it, it's fine. Uh, I, I get it. I mean, my dad was considered to be a criminal. I, uh, of course, you would think his son was too. Him just tugging on their heartstrings, making them feel bad for the accusations. Then looking dead ass at Snyder's like, how dare you corrupt us. So, ah. Hey, I just said trailer. You guys make him, you, you two said vigilante. So, them going back and forth, going at each other's throats. So like, yeah. Until they just, you know what, we're sorry. We're sorry for accusing you. And please accept our apology. He's a good tearing up, but they just slowly start to dry up. I mean, he doesn't give a such a rousing performance as Amber, but still, he's he's still pretty much like okay. Uh, I understand. Just if you do need help, at least let me know. As he just walks out of there, and oh, thank you, Jesus! Oh, thank the gods I got out of that one. Ooh. Uh, but seriously, so there, I still gotta find this whole traitor. Hmm. Nothing I need is for any of the students to get hurt. He tells Nagan she's pretty much laughing her ass off. Like, I can't believe you almost. You were so close to getting caught and arrested. All for a fight. Hey. It's not my fault. Gosh, he has such a strong quirk. Hey, do you. Do you know how hard it is for me to actually redirect his explosions? Especially with him using them in rapid succession. It was a hot day today. So he was sweating up a real storm. But still, you won. Yeah, yeah I won. Doesn't make it any better, but still. Ugh. Okay, so what? So how have you uh, been doing when it comes to imbuement? Uh, I got better at it. Good. Now I'm made fulfilling our, you know, plan even more easy. But still, woman, you gotta really consider the fact that how close I was to shitting myself. From what I heard, you did enough of that. Not my fault. I was terrified. I really thought I was made. You have no idea how scary that is. Really? Try almost dying. I, I saved you. Yeah, but you weren't supposed to find me to begin with.
Yeah, I, yeah, I guess they yeah, look at that is my fault. Yeah, damn right it's your fault. I forgive you, but still, it's. I almost died because of your ass. Okay, yeah, you, you say you forgive me and everything, but then you go ahead and do this. You, you make me feel so bad. Good. You should feel bad for, for almost having me killed. Do you at least feel bad for having me traumatized over killing my dad? Oh, please. Your dad's over. Your dad traumatized you as soon as he started to become a real asshole. Can't blame that on me. Hey, when you write. Kid, I'm older than you, and I am wiser, so yeah, you, you can't pull that sh bullshit on me. It was a good try, though, so there's something. Only thing is, Izuku, while on patrol, yeah, she does come across Stain. Only thing is, Stain, he's like, so you are a vigilante. The villain killer, Shadow Walker, and you are Stain, the hero killer. So, you're after all the fake heroes, right? Yes. Then why did you go after Ingenium? <laughs> yeah, listen, listen, that's different. See, I let him live. Does not make it right. From what I've heard, you pretty much ruined his hero career. No, no, no. I just gave him a hold of his perspective. He will never walk again. So you pretty much took out a true hero. He was in the way. So, what's going to happen here? I don't know. Part of me actually agrees partly with your message. It's just not the way you're doing it. And? I kind of want to arrest you. I also kind of want to let you go. Really? Not very hero like. I'm not a hero. I'm a vigilante. <laughs> uh, some people will disagree with you. Yeah, possibly. But still, I'll have my day. I'm about to get my back against the wall. Nowhere less else to turn to. Nowhere to run. But right now, this is about you and me. So, what are we going to do here? <laughs> I doubt I can actually beat you in a real head to head fight. If anything. I believe you could easily beat me. Hmm. I even think you are a really good hero. Tch. Oh, sorry, vigilante. <laughs> but I still got work to do. And so do I. So... What are we gonna do here? We gonna fight? I really don't want to because I know I'm most likely gonna lose. No, you will lose if you fight me. No doubt. 
cocky bastard. So, how about I give you another option, stay? Fight with me. Don't become a hero killer or villain. Be a vigilante instead. What? Fight with me, but this whole killing heroes thing is going to have to stop. What? You heard me. Only villains. I, you expect me to agree to that? You don't have a choice. Either say yes to it or I become less civil. <laughs> I have no say in the matter, do I? No. Alright. I'll think about it. Them being gone. And pretty much, that's the end of it for now. Or is it? Talk about perfect timing. <laughs>